Technology is one of the most fundamental areas of any civilization. The ability to create and build is a defining characteristic of human beings. Thanks to science and technology, we have gained knowledge about other planets, galaxies and various organisms, including our own bodies, viruses, bacteria, and the cells that make us up. The capacity for creation can be so advanced that even we ourselves cannot decipher it. There are many mysteries that still remain from ancient cultures. In this video, we will explore examples of ancient creations and discoveries that humanity, even in modern times, has been unable to explain. But before we delve deeper, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and activate notifications to stay updated with our latest content. Number 1. The Mighty Viking Swords Armament is an area that has always driven technological development, as wars have been frequent, and inevitable in all human civilizations. Swords were the most widely used weapons in the medieval world and dominated warfare until the advent of gunpowder. However, none are as perfect as the Ulfbert swords used by the Vikings. You might be surprised, but obtaining a good sword was not as simple, it was expensive and challenging to make them strong and durable. That's why Viking swords stood out in their time. They were superior to others, sharper, stronger, and more flexible. This was due to their technological manufacturing process. Ulfbert swords were made by combining iron and carbon to create steel. It was a delicate mixture, too much carbon would make the sword brittle, while too little would cause it to bend. The Ulfbert swords had a perfect distribution of carbon, and that's where the mystery lies. We still don't know how the craftsmen, whose identities remain unclear, accomplished this process, avoiding impurities in the sword's material. In fact, their production cannot be replicated on a large scale without the technology developed during the Industrial Revolution. Today, there are still around 170 Ulfbert swords, all with the Viking-style double-edged blade and the name Ulfbert stamped on them. However, this posed another problem in their time. They became popular for their quality, and it is estimated that they were sold for about 200 years. As a result, many other manufacturers started stamping the name Ulfbert on their swords, even if they were not of the same quality. This greatly complicated the identification of the real makers and the fakes, making it a challenging task for archaeologists to definitively determine who created this weapon. Number 2, The Mystery of Drepanosaurus Thanks to archaeology and science, we have a relatively clear idea of what dinosaurs looked like in most cases. We usually associate them with large reptile-like bodies. However, fossils of the so-called Drepanosaurus have challenged some of these beliefs. A study published in 2016 revealed details that would change our understanding of reptile evolution. According to the study, Drepanosaurus fossils indicate that this dinosaur had long claws for digging insects in the mud. It had a bird-like head and a chameleon-like body. But what made it truly strange were its extremities, which were particularly long and muscular. In most four-legged animals, the forelimbs follow the same rules. In the forearms of a Tyrannosaurus rex or an elephant, for example, there are always two bones, the radius and the ulna, which manifest as elongated, slender, and parallel axes. Adam S. Pritchard, who led the research at Yale University, explained, what's curious is that Drepanosaurus doesn't have these parallel bones and breaks the known patterns of four-legged animals or limbs. It seems that this dinosaur individually developed adaptations to the ecosystem, breaking away from the evolutionary line of most other animals. Furthermore, Drepanosaurus disappeared at the end of the Triassic period, and its form was not inherited by any later creature. Its peculiar shape was literally unique in history, at least until now. Number 3, the ALH 84001 meteorite. For nearly three decades, the scientific community has witnessed a space controversy. 
In 1996, NASA scientists David Mackey and Everett Gibson claimed to have found fossils within a Martian meteorite. Examining these remains in the laboratory, they discovered a structure the size of a bacterium that appeared to have a dozen segments, a head, and a tail. It was an unthinkable discovery. Soon, they found other structures they called swimmers, which also seemed to derive from cell-like structures. This discovery marked a milestone in space technology and led to the creation of a new discipline, astrobiology. However, the scientists did not expect the enormous negative response to their findings. Religious groups questioned the science contradicting their beliefs, and critics deemed the research impossible. Nevertheless, decades later, the results remain valid, and the general consensus is that the rocks formed on Mars, with carbonates deposited in a watery environment at temperatures between 25 and 30 degrees Celsius. Although critics of this meteorite have been unable to discredit the study, we still don't know what form of life these apparent bacteria could be and in what period they formed. These mysteries remain unsolved. Number 4, Africa's oldest dinosaur, Envirosaurus rati. In the summer of 2022, a group of paleontologists announced the discovery of the oldest dinosaur remains ever recorded in Africa. Named Envirosaurus rati, this creature is estimated to have measured just over 1.8 meters and weighed between 9 and 29 kilograms. This species would have lived in what is now Zimbabwe about 230 million years ago. Analysis of the fossils revealed that it was a species related to sauropods, which walked on all fours and had long necks and tails. The skeleton was found during two expeditions in 2017 and 2019. This fossil would be the oldest dinosaur for which we have information. There are very few fossil samples from 230 million years ago. Until now, remains from this ancient period had only been found in Argentina, Brazil, and India. However, due to the scarcity of samples from this prehistoric period, many questions about this ancient dinosaur remain unanswered. Number 5, The Voynich Manuscript. The Voynich Manuscript was acquired in the early 20th century by bibliophile Wilfred Voynich, after whom it is named. For decades, this manuscript has perplexed linguists, cryptographers, and specialists. It is written in a completely unknown script, which some have described as a unique code or language. Despite the efforts of numerous experts, no one has been able to decipher its content, or determine its origin and purpose. The manuscript consists of 240 illustrated pages filled with drawings of exotic plants, astronomical symbols, human figures, and diagrams of strange mechanisms. The writing style and textual characteristics suggest that it was written during the 15th century, but the author and historical context remain an enigma even today. Number 6, The Antikythera Mechanism. The Antikythera Mechanism is an archaeological artifact that has baffled researchers for decades. Discovered in 1901 in a shipwreck near the island of Antikythera, Greece, this device is an ancient analog or mechanical computer. It consists of gears and cogwheels and dates back to the 2nd century BC. It is believed to be an astronomical and astrological artifact created with the purpose of indicating celestial movements and calculating astronomical cycles, including lunar and solar eclipses. How were the ancient Greeks able to develop such a machine? It remains unknown. One of the most perplexing aspects is that there is no evidence of similar technological creations until centuries later. This mechanism is still a mystery, and not all the fragments that compose it have been found. However, it is undoubtedly a testament to the levels of technological advancement achieved, and perhaps lost, during ancient times. Number 7, The Beigong Pipes in China. In a region where there is no evidence of residence or industry near the mountain top, three mysterious triangular openings can be found. These openings contain hundreds of rusted iron pipes, 
many of which are deeply inserted into the mountain. Some of the pipes have a fairly regular arrangement, indicating intentional design. The problem is that archaeologists have attributed their installation to a time when fire was not yet mastered. How could metallic pipes have been manufactured? Science still has no answer. Number 8, the stone spheres of Costa Rica. In a deforested area of Costa Rica, a series of smooth surfaced stone spheres were discovered. It is estimated that there are more than 500 spherical rocks, mainly in the southern part of the country. These rocks were sculpted by local indigenous communities between the years 400 and 500 AD and were used until the Spanish colonization era, a millennium later. Also known as the Stone Spheres of Costa Rica, these particular rocks are considered a UNESCO World Heritage Site since 2014 and are a symbol of Costa Rican identity. They were discovered in 1939 during deforestation carried out by the United Fruit Company, an American company, to cultivate bananas. The mystery lies in the unknown purpose or utility of these spheres, as well as their creation during an era with significant technological limitations for pre-Columbian inhabitants. Number 9, the Baghdad Batteries. Discovered in the 1930s near Baghdad, Iraq, these mysterious artifacts are terracotta jars with a copper cylinder inside and an iron electrode. Their design resembles primitive batteries. These devices date back to the 1st century BC to the 3rd century AD. There has been much speculation about their purpose. Some suggest they could have been used for metallurgical or galvanic purposes, such as electrolysis for metal deposition. However, no conclusive evidence of their specific use in antiquity has been found. Number 10, the ruins of Otlit Yam. The ruins of Otlit Yam are a fascinating archaeological discovery located underwater in the Mediterranean Sea near the coast of Israel. These submerged ruins, dating back to around 7000 BC, are the remains of a prehistoric city that was once on land before being inundated by rising sea levels. What makes them truly mysterious is their remarkable preservation. Despite belonging to the Neolithic period, archaeologists have found houses, structured streets, even a cemetery, all well preserved underwater. The findings include everyday objects such as stone tools, ceramics and food remains, providing a unique insight into life in this ancient community. How this locality ended up submerged and why its remains have been preserved for millennia still remains a mystery. Number 11, the King of Rats. The King of Rats is a mythical phenomenon that is believed to occur when several rats intertwine their tails to the point of forming an impossible knot. It is believed that this rat union becomes a leader of the species, capable of directing other rats to provide it with food. The mystery of this phenomenon lies in how it happens. It is not clear how such strong knots could be formed among rats, which typically exhibit individualistic behavior that prioritizes their comfort. Some believe it is a human invention, while others argue that it is technically possible, at least in very cold weather, for a group of rats to become entangled if their tails come into contact with a sticky substance. Number 12 the tomb of the first emperor of China. In 1974, a group of farmers discovered the tomb of the first emperor of China, one of the most famous archaeological finds in history. An enormous army of terracotta soldiers was excavated near the tomb, which is buried beneath a hill. However, despite being a globally recognized monument, the exact contents of the tomb remain unknown. Archaeologists have refrained from excavating the site for several reasons. Firstly, the Chinese government does not permit further excavations due to insufficient technology to ensure the preservation of the site. Secondly, Chinese historical documents claim that the tomb is surrounded by a river of mercury. Soil tests in the area have confirmed this assertion. As a result, the interior and contents of this tomb remain an unresolved mystery. Number 13, the Sumerian King List. Discovered in the early 20th century by scholar German Lafont, 
The Sumerian king list is a cuneiform tablet dating back approximately 4,000 years. The object is a historical document that includes accounts of mythical and real kings of ancient Sumer. However, it is still a mystery because historians have been unable to decipher the purpose of including fictional kings on this tablet. Number 14, The Shroud of Turin. One of the legendary objects associated with Jesus Christ is the Shroud of Turin, a cloth measuring just over 4 meters in length believed to have been placed over Christ's body after his crucifixion. The shroud bears the imprint of the face of the deceased and is considered an ancient relic. However, researchers have estimated that this object dates back to 1260 AD, more than a millennium after his death. Whether it belonged to Jesus and how the features of the body were imprinted on the cloth are still unanswered questions for science. Number 15, the Atacama Skeleton. In 2003, researchers discovered a small and peculiar human-shaped skeleton in the Atacama Desert in Chile, known as Atta. This skeleton measured a mere 15 centimeters in height, leading many to speculate that it was a fetus or even an extraterrestrial. However, DNA analysis of the bones proved that it was neither. It was indeed human, but the reason for its extremely small size is still unknown. Some believe it could be a body with dwarfism, or a malformation. Number 16, the London Hammer. Discovered in 1938, the London Hammer is a rather ancient tool believed to have been crafted around 100,000 years ago. This implies that it would have been created long before the official record of the earliest use of hammers by humanity. Some skeptics suggest that while the metal is old, the complete assembly of the tool is not. On the other hand, some specialists have estimated a much more recent creation date, around 700 years ago, during the 12th or 13th centuries AD. However, controversies have not been able to provide evidence against the hammer's manufacturing date, leaving its true history still an enigma. Number 17, the Puerta del Sol. This monument is a stone arch located near Lake Titicaca in Bolivia, and is attributed to pre-Columbian communities in the region. Archaeologists who have studied the Puerta del Sol believe it was part of a great empire that existed around the 1st century AD. However, the true mystery surrounding this gate lies in its engravings. The drawings etched on the stone have yet to be deciphered to this day. However, it is believed that they may contain relevant and revealing astronomical information about this culture. Number 18, Rongo Rongo Tablets. Discovered during the 19th century on Easter Island, where the mythical Maya statues are found, the Rongo Rongo tablets bear inscriptions in an unknown language. Rongo Rongo is the name given to the writing system found on these wooden tablets, which consists of pictorial symbols. The problem is that researchers have no idea how to translate this language, and therefore, they do not understand the purpose of the tablets. Number 19, the Volgograd Discs. In 2015, a group of Russian researchers discovered over a dozen stone discs in the Volgograd region. What is astonishing about this finding is that the discs were made of tungsten, a high-density metal commonly used in military devices. The origin of these discs remains a mystery, but many hypothesize that they are UFOs, perhaps belonging to extraterrestrial life. Number 20, Roman dodecahedrons. These hollow objects, created with a copper alloy during the 2nd and 3rd centuries AD in the Roman Empire, have the shape of a dodecahedron with 12 flat pentagonal faces, each featuring a circular hole in the center. At least 116 dodecahedrons have been found since 1739 in various European countries such as Austria, Belgium, France, Germany, Hungary, Luxembourg, the United Kingdom, Switzerland, and the Netherlands. There are two different sized dodecahedrons, ranging from 4 to 11 centimeters. However, their function remains unknown. There is no mention or record of these artifacts in historical accounts, treatises, or even artworks. 
they lack numbers or engravings, so it is not believed that they had utility as measuring instruments. Some theorize that they could be religious or superstitious objects, but there is nothing to support or refute these ideas. They simply remain a complete mystery. Number 21, a series of Stone Age tunnels. Throughout Europe, a vast network of underground tunnels dating back to the Neolithic period, around 12,000 years ago, has been discovered. Despite numerous investigations, their purpose and construction methods remain unknown. Some believe that they served as a security system, with ancient humans using these tunnels to protect themselves from predators, harsh climates, or conflicts with other human groups. However, these are all hypotheses, as there is no evidence to support these ideas. While science has made great strides, there are still many things we don't understand about the world, including our own humanity. Each of these discoveries, however, showcases the fascinating human capacity for learning and creation. Above all, they fuel curiosity, a fundamental quality that has driven the development and growth of our civilizations throughout history. We hope this video has been informative to you. If you have anything to add, please share it with us in the comments section. Don't forget to like this video and share the link with your family and friends so that they too can learn more about the 21 ancient discoveries that science cannot explain. Thanks for watching. If you found this video interesting, make sure to subscribe to our channel and give this video a like. We'll be back soon with more curiosities from history.